boots. So, there's a quick glimpse. Just take them out. Here you can see them in the brightest sunlight. This is, of course, Adidas Predators Freak point one with the new demon skin outers so the demon skin is not just the spiky pattern although that will probably be the main feature the demon skin is actually the colorway and the pattern uh, that you can see here in the blue with uh, what looks like scales let me just pick that up for you maybe you can see it better obviously when I do this you can also see how the spikes protrude quite a long way the idea behind the spikes is more swerve on the ball, more control perhaps. And I'll, let me just say this right off the bat, this is a, a pro level boot. So Adidas's elite boot uh, players will be wearing these. People like Paul Pogba, who uh, naturally gifted anyway, and these spikes might just give them a little bit extra. I'm not quite sure if he was wearing them on was it Wednesday night against Fulham when he scored that beauty uh, off the right hand side with his left foot. But maybe one of you can leave a comment and and uh, let us know. I didn't I didn't actually notice if he was or wasn't. Regardless, so here you can see the profile. They actually stick up. I want to say two to three millimeters. And you can see they go all, all the way around from the outside of your right, well this is the right boot, so on the outside of your right heel here, they start, and then they go all the way around, past the instep, to the other heel, where it says Demon Skin, so the branding there, obviously the Predator range from Adidas, so nice and big label there, and then on the back of the boot, very very small Adidas label. So I think it's a trend that the boot manufacturers are going to at the moment with uh, minimal branding in terms of lettering. But uh, you know, if you are the three stripes brand, your three stripes will be quite prominent. One thing I want to show you, but I, I need a second hand, is how flexible this boot is and how, how you can just twist the sole. Let me see if I can make a plan. Right, so here you're going to see how this boot twists. You see that? That is fantastic flexibility. And that, that all just helps your foot adjust when, when you when you run. If, 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 imagine if your boot was rigid. So now imagine if it's not as flexible. So the more flexible the boot, the more comfortable it is when you run. So nice features on the boot, obviously the color, it's yellow fading into the black, just nice contrast there. I would imagine that this texture here is just cosmetic. Then the colorway, this, uh, I keep wanting to say uh, lizard skin effect, but all right, let's just call it the demon skin. Interesting pattern, it's nice, obviously this is dominating the landscape it's really just interesting I, I'm yet to kick a ball I'm really looking forward to seeing if it makes much of a difference but, uh, they say it does something that does concern me is how this front part ends here and then the part on the heel starts again halfway through the foot I'm a little bit concerned that maybe you know the the rubber will start to lift or whatever material it might be glued on and, and as you wear you know, it uh, will reduce the the functioning life of the boot because well let's not be shy they are very expensive at 5,000 rand which translates roughly to 250 pounds so that's a that's an expensive pair of shoes looking at the heel it's got a little bit of extra strength uh, material here so the heel part here 
strengthened so that you can open it to, to get your foot in which is really helpful because it is a tight fit and uh, I'm going to put them on now and you'll, you'll, you'll get an idea but beautifully made shoes lovely colors lovely design revolutionary I would say and uh, I'm really looking forward to playing them so this is going to be awkward again with uh, just one hand and I'm not quite sure how to get around that so let's see if we can do this with one hand so here you can see how tight the upper is with the, the sock fit to get your foot in and uh, my size 10 boats you need to go through that little hole at the top so, as you can see you hold that little tab and you can push your foot in it's quite a snug fit there we go she's actually looking a bit big considering it's the right size okay maybe uh need to tie the laces properly anyway now, there we go let me just tie the laces quickly all right so there we go both of them on view from above is quite impressive hopefully my game is uh, worthy of these boots but, uh, yeah very comfy so how flexible they were so they they mold around your feet easily and uh, I'm really looking forward to a game hopefully next week sometime thank you for sitting through this awkward video subscribe leave a comment if you have any questions and thank you for watching and thank you adidas for sending us a pair